Being a great community bank means staying in step with the latest technology. With West Tennessee Bank Mobile Banking, you get banking services simply by pulling your smartphone out of your pocket. West Tennessee Bank, a division of Decatur County Bank. We think you'll like us. Equal Housing Lender Member, FDIC.
So what we offered was a survey monkey survey where every well everybody had the opportunity to survey. So of the 200 plus teachers, we had 171 that surveyed, and 68 uh, percent uh, suggested or agreed to the July the 22nd. That is a Friday, and then following Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, the following week for their four days of optional in service. The 29th was already established, that will be our county-wide. And um, the days that we have built in for staff development, if you notice, coincide with the election cycle. We have two in the fall this time, one's gonna be August the 4th, which is almost right out of the gate, but that's the state primary election day. And uh, then November 8th, of course, that's the presidential election day. Um, and then the repeat of the staff development the first day back in the second semester. Um, I noticed in the, an article in Independent that uh, the Election Commission expects to have a high turnout with voters. So, uh, again, we want to be conscientious of the fact that with East, West, and Jackson Creek being utilized as polling stations, if there's going to be an increase, which is what we were led to believe, then we want to diminish the need for school safety and keeping our students at home. So. Make a motion when is the calendar? When is it? When's the general election? It's August the fourth. It's, 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 it's county oh, election. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm sorry. Oh, I can read your plan. Okay, we got a motion. We have a second. second. Right. We have a motion and second. Can we approve the school calendar for 2016-17? Any other discussion? All in favor, say aye. Aye. Opposed, no. <coughs> All right. Then we approve the calendar. All right, that is everything on our agenda for the meeting tonight. At this time, I want to adjourn the meeting, and the board will be going into executive session. And we'll have to ask everyone if they will please go home and have a good evening.
bid opening at the first or somewhere near February. And and when we have that bid opening, do we need to do a special call meeting so you can see yeah. the bids before we say yeah, you your pay? And I don't know a, a firm date on that, but as soon as we have that bid opening, I guess we'll try to, however it works, to get a special call meeting so y'all can look at it what came in uh, but that's where we're at so far with that and then finally the plaque and she'll come back <laughs> I have researched and researched and researched it all I, I just say I'm the my, I guess my advice is you just tell me what y'all want to do and I'll go do if you want to post it on a metal ornamental metal I'll go get it done I'll tell me get a secret post <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm just gonna get one of the memorial things on the ground but if you want to research the metal, I, I did uh, reach out to Marty Jones of uh, Mason, and he gave me a price on doing something. It was, you know, four by five and inset in the plaque and surrounded by brick and a capstone. But that was labor and all. Even with the base, about a thousand dollars. That's everything, including the materials. Right now, I, I did call up Ornamental Iron Company out of Jackson. I described him about what I was. I think that's what y'all want on something nice. He was thinking maybe four hundred fifty dollars. It could be more or less, but that both those prices don't include the plaque. I don't know what that costs. But if, I would say just give me a record. If you want to go with the ornamental iron, I'll I'll give you something as well. Any other questions? I got a question. We talked about it at one time. Yeah. Putting it on the building. How much trouble is that going to be? Not as much. That's what. I'm and it would be there. It wouldn't be tore down. I mean, we'll do whatever we want to, but I know we talked about that. But putting it big enough where it can be read. If I don't know. There's some good focal walls under there. It would be fine there, but I just want it to look pretty. You know, yeah, be, a, be, be prominent know. wherever you put it. I don't, I don't want it to look horrible or get it damaged. I, I don't think the location that, uh, that we've been talking about, I don't think it would be in any too much danger where it was at if you wanted to go with the one in the line, but the building would be easier. That wall would be nice to be here. I believe it would look better on the stand. Okay. I think. Target price on there. Just make sure to stay. Fifty bucks. <laughs> I get some angle iron in my welder. I'll get my torch. <laughs> 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 Anybody else? I mean, it's probably a thousand dollars. I mean, yeah. to make it look right. Yeah. It's yeah. Probably a and I mean, and it needs to look right. I mean, just let's get it done. Yeah. I wonder, do you want to build it up with the block? Like no, I, I, the ornamental iron, iron, I think, would, would look better. I think. Okay. If they don't jump on me. I think that's everything that I was on the for.